What's up, demons, and welcome back to Star Swirl Academy Demo. Last time we met, we went on a tour with Pinky through most of the school, I'm assuming. And then we looked at Fluttershy from a bush. Sounds weird, but I don't care. The first thing I notice is the striking pink hair that reaches down to her waist. Where Pinky's darker and more vibrant, her hair looks soft and looks like glowing in the sunlight. She's feeding some goats that are side of the main building, as well as a few other smaller critters. I think even squirrels come by to have a bite to eat. What does the campus need with goats, though? It's weird seeing live animals on a school campus. Though I can tell one thing for sure, those animals really seem to like her. Pinky, who's that? Her name is Fluttershy. She's in charge of making sure all the animals on campus are kept fed and healthy. And now we're going to ask why we're hiding. Why do you guys have animals on campus? I click the button. Thank you. Alright. They're part of the Agriculture Club, too, though a different section. There's a bunch of other animals in the shed back there. She seems happy with it. Besides, she also has friends like me and Dashy to help her out if she never needs it. So it all works out. That's right, that's who we haven't met yet. Dash. Let me see. Well, that's good. Yep, yep. I'd introduce you two personally, but she's a little busy with the animals for now. And they get a little skittish around new people. So we'll have to save it for later. Come on, there's more of us to see and more of for us to see and still. This time Pinky grabs our wrist and drags us off quickly. I think of starting to get used to it. As we look back, I notice the flesh turns to watch us sprinting away. Ah, here's Dash. Passing through the garden quickly. We emerge on the other side, directly in front of a track field. It seems rather busy, though. There are a lot of students just always running laps around the course. Looks all warm up. Any questions, you two? Questions? I wasn't expecting that. I thought we were just going to have to talk forever. Now, one thing keeps bothering me. No, not really. The balloon on your uniform. Does everyone have something like that? Oh, you two haven't heard of it? Heard about it? She gasps in mock surprise. At least I think it's mock surprise. Could be the real thing. Now that you mention it, I think Derpy had a pin too. Bubble! Her nose scrunches up while she tries to remember. She does the same piece of information and escapes her. It doesn't happen often, but I have to say, she looks kind of cute when she does it. Nice change from her normal demeanor. Is it a club insignia? Do you have a balloon so party committee? Pinky laughs. Oh, oh, close. This is a student flair, not as official as a student club. She got really quiet when she said the last part. Is it necessarily to whisper about something that you can see as plain as day on your uniform? She's acting like talking about it as a plausible by death. Punishable. Oh, right. Headmaster Celestia mentioned it once. It's a symbol representing one's personality or hobby. God damn it! Only when I'm recording. Bingo! That's right. Twy is just beaming. She really does enjoy being right, even if it's something as trivial as this. Every year, the first the first years are presented with their own flair as the Fall Festival. It's given to them by the upperclassmen who's gotten to know them the best. But you two are new, so we'll pretend you're first years. So if I hang out with the school band, so if you hang out with the school band, you probably end up with a tuba or something. It's usually pretty personal, though. She points to her flair. I'm head cheerleader, but my flair has nothing to do with cheering. Well, unless I bring balloons, which I do sometimes. Hmm, I need to buy more balloons. She stares off into space. None of this is in the handbook. I read it six times. Why do I get the feeling she's understanding the nut number? Well, duh. It wouldn't be. Yeah, he said it wasn't official. Bingo part two. Electronic bingaloo. Okay, I get it. Elect electric scootaloo. I don't know what that's from. Someone told me at one point, but I totally forgot. So someone mentioned what it was that 
was referenced because I know there was a panel at RTX that was electric scootaloo. So someone mentioned what that is, and I'll get back to you never. I'll thank you, but that's about it. What? But it's part of the uniform. No, it's it. No, it's not, silly. It's entirely off the record. Real hush hush. The school just doesn't do anything about it. It's addition to super long, long time. Hush hush. Is she for real? Didn't why I just say Celestia told her about it? Motherfucker! Go away! Only when I'm recording. I think the dress is older than the school itself, actually. How is that even. What do the teachers do about it? Where'd my mouse go? There it is. Excuse me. But you just said that Celestia. Oh! No one really minds. One time I even saw Miss Celestia compliment a student on theirs. I. So I'll be getting one too? Of course, everybody gets one. Yeah, it'll be a bookworm. So it looks like she just smelled something gross. What? No! I don't want a worm on my uniform. She tends up a little actual worm on her shirt. Oh, I don't worry. As long as you get to know someone, you're bound to get something super awesome. Mm, what happens if you end up getting one to know someone actually has their flair? What? Wait, so what happens if you don't end up getting to know someone who already has their flair? Well, it doesn't happen often. But it does happen. Um, there were three blanks last year. A blank? I'm definitely going to get mine. She looks determined. I think she's getting too worked up over this. I wonder, though. I hope there's no do. I hope there's no. Do blanks get treated the same? It seems like something that might cause teasing. I think it looks a bit more su subdued while we talk about it. And I swear she's deflated like a, a little bit. Balloon indeed. Honestly, they're harder on themselves than anyone else. There are always a few students who enjoy poking fun, but not any worse than anything else they could tease someone for. There's always no rule saying that a blank can't assign themselves flair if they really wanted to. Really? So I could decide what mine is right now? Well, yeah, but what's special about that? What do you mean? That perked her up. She's all bubbly again. The flair is just part of it. Finding out what gives you your flair is half the fun. She chases the balloon on her uniform absentmindedly. So who gave you your flair? Pinky Miles. It isn't her goofy smile. It's like she's remembering something bittersweet. It's strange, she doesn't... It's like she's a different person all of a sudden. It's no good either. You can't just ask someone. Flair sort of intimidate. It's like showing how much you care about someone. I'm just thinking... Sorry. Okay. That threw me off for a minute, because it's like... Hmm. <laughs> I'm like... So, this is the thing. How can I change it up to where I can do something to it? And that's all I thought. I see. So, Flair can be a very personal thing. Hence why she didn't say outright who it was that gave her her Flair, I guess. Exactly. So, did the blanks end up choosing their own Flares? No, the three from last year have been ag agonizing over finding their own special talent. They want to earn theirs from their classmates. That's admirable. Mm-hmm. They're really focused, too. That's that goofy smile again. Pinky releases an exaggerated gas pointing at the track. Students are running now. They obviously finished warming up from... Their blah, blah, blah. Ooh, she seems to be doing well. Who is? Pinky clears her throat. So as you can see, this is Star Swirl Academy, award-winning track and field area. Only the best of the best come from schools to compete on this track. And ours and our students are used to always put up the best performance. So she's just going to North Twilight's question then, huh? 
A lot of things here at Star Wars are some of the best around, but the track team is one of the more well-known ones. Star Wars comes from its first place almost every year. So she's going... God damn it. Hold on. I, I fucked up. Yep. Okay, there we go. A lot of things here at Star Wars are some of the best around. Okay, I just read that one. Almost every year? Yeah, almost. Usually we win first, but last year we got second place. Still, that's nothing to sneeze at. Star Wars' reputation just seems to be growing and growing. That's quite a reputation. Is that why the students always seem to be working so hard? You could say that. I think they know just how much it means to me at the school and try to be the best at what they can do. If you watch closely, you can see the determination in everyone's faces. You really want to keep winning streak going. Looking at the students running, you can tell Pinky's telling the truth. All of them look determined to make the end do better than they currently are. It's an interesting sign to behold, especially considering even if I had my own goals, they wouldn't be barely as lofty. Oh, oh, watch this! I think she's going to try and beat her record. Pinky points to us in the direction of a specific student. It's easy to figure out who she's talking about. The girl with rainbow hair stands out in the crowd. Her coach has raised her starting pistol and... Bang! The girl flies from her... The girl flies from her starting position. I must admit, I don't think I've ever seen someone move so fast that fast in a per I don't think I've ever seen someone move that fast in person before. Only a moment later, she crosses the finish line and the coach marks her time. Wow, she really moves fast. Racing is her life, honestly. I don't think... God damn it! That's gonna piss me off. Um, I don't think she thinks about anything other than racer. Racing. She kind of has the one-track mind at times. Sounds like the two of them have a lot in common. Ooh, looks like she almost... Looks like she has a moment. Dash! Dashy! I think he suddenly yells out, waving her arms frantically. The girl with her notice and jogs over. Damn! Nuff said. Oh, hey, Pinks. Class is over for you already? I'm so busy training, I didn't even notice. Yep, classes are done for the day. But I did want to find these two students outside the main building, so I was giving the tour a star swirl. Star, yeah, 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 star swirl. The old Pinkie Pie Grand Tour Deluxe, huh? Certainly been a while. Yep, I think they transferred from town from new blah, blah, just now too. Kids, Violet, this is Rainbow Dash. Nice to meet you, Rainbow. Uh, hey there. So you two are what third years, fourth? Wow, well, you two are nuts. Uh, well, she certainly lives up to her name. I didn't think it was possible to lack that much subtlety without about yourself, but something about her demeanor just screams that she isn't a very subtle person at all. God damn! Well, hey, what brings you guys to Star Swirl then? Well, the academics mostly. Star Swirl is pretty much my dream school. No, I can't afford to come here sooner. I'm just happy I can make it my senior year. Uh, I came here for that pretty much as well. I'm hoping to learn a lot. I think that's entirely a lie, though I'm not really interested in learning too much. Oh, that's cool. If you guys think about joining the track team, though, I'd do it now rather than later. Competition is looking pretty tough this year. We're going to need some extra training if we're going to keep up. Well, thank you. I'll be alright. Racing isn't exactly my thing. I've probably read more books about racing than I've experienced it. Yeah, I don't know if running's what I'd be interested in. Well, see yourself. It's not like there's much to do anyway. I'm planning to go on a very top. I won't stop. I won't stop for anything else. Anything less. Sorry. Well, I wish you luck in your goal then. Thanks. I'm gonna head back to training. See you around, Pinky. Still damn. Well, that's gonna end the video. I hope you enjoyed the strategy of demon today, and I'll see you guys next time in Star Swirl Academy demo.
Yay.